Hello, it is day six and we are in the echoey staircase outside my front door. We are getting ready to go out for a run, marathon training plan. And the last video I did was day four. I managed to do a run and achieve the pace target, hit those five miles, third time in the week. Now today we are going for a 12 mile run, which is quite a jump, but it's, it's, it's your long run, so it's normally these are longer runs. And I decided to take a complete rest day on day 5, which is Friday. I didn't even do a workout. I watched some videos, read some books, and I thought it would probably be good to try and have one day where I don't just not run, but I don't do any workouts either, so just kind of let the body just have a little break. But also, my mind, I mean, just a break from doing the videos, running, preparing and everything else. There's a lot that goes into having your running gear ready, alarm clocks, and then shaping the rest of your commitments, um, and holding that on the balance. So yesterday I didn't have to worry about anything, I could just get on with the day, and it felt good. It was very nice. So here we are, 12 miles. We're aiming for an eight, uh, eight minutes per mile pace. It's a little bit slower. I might struggle. I might find it easy. If I stand here, if I struggle, I'll just try to hold that pace. And if I get slower, then I will keep it all recorded on my Strava, and next time I go for a long run, I will hope to improve on that. So I can't lose. If I have a really slow time, I will just use that as a benchmark to improve on. And if I hit the target and get 12 miles in 8 minute mile pace, and I finish in an hour and a half, or thereabouts, an hour and 36 minutes, then I'll be happy. If I'm finding it easy, I will try to do the second to last mile a little bit quicker, maybe the last mile a bit quicker, and have that sort of negative split, and they call it. Um, but we'll see how I'm feeling, how I'm doing. I tend to warm up. Like I start a warm, then a work, core workout was brilliant. I'm going to do that more often. It really was good for ankle stability. Um, then the workout feel warm, nicely, you know, dynamic stretches. I will go and do a run. But once I'm into my run, I take about 40 minutes and then something just falls into place and I feel much better and I tend to then go on into my longer runs and hold a reasonable pace. So it would be interesting to see what happens. I've been running up until about 37 minutes, so I have not felt that sort of where everything falls into place and I get into my stride and my rhythm. Um, so that might, that'll definitely, I'll, that should happen today. And where I sit in my natural rhythm in terms of an eight minute pace or seven and a half minute pace, We'll have to see. Anyway, <clears throat> day six, day five was complete rest, no videos, no workouts, nothing, just enjoy life. And we're back at it today. We've got 12 miles to hit, and uh, yeah, optimistic. Let's go!